My name's Denise. Yeah, I'm Chuck. Do we talk to the camera or do we look straight ahead? We're just a normal family. Just a normal couple. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey, what's this for? Here's for my film class. Oh. Hey, I need a, like a measuring stick. You know where I left the measuring stick? Where'd you leave the measuring stick? Down us. Da oh, uh, no. We have a daughter, uh, Meredith. Yeah, she's a little uh, scandalous one. She's, <laughs> a, she's a bit of a whore. Like, okay. <laughs> Come but she's... we love her. You know, I don't really like this kind of fur. I think but next time you go to... We... Can you just be happy where you are once we in your life? We should put some... Focus. What you know. channel will this be on? Yeah, what channel? Nine? Would it be on we, Hallmark? We love Nine. The acting in this is so great. The acting in these Hallmark movies is incredible. It's so good. Such good storytelling. It always ends with a nice, happy story. Oh! Oh, okay. Our yeah. youngest is Dave. Yeah, he's a little, a little 19 year old. <laughs> he's still in his room. Cool and how press. do you know Dave again? That's not a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Our kids should watch this. They'll get some inspiration. Our children are fed up. They, hmm? I what? forgot to offer you a snack. Oh, yeah, you, like you want a statues? snack, Mr. Spielberg? <laughs> They're dry, what? roasted, and unsalted. I love those, honey, but you should get the, the caramel crusted ones. Caramel. I don't have any more coupons. You didn't check the drawer on the left. She's he was such Brian's a good guy earlier. Screen. Now he's just a hey. bad guy. I moved it over because the one on the right has the utensils, and I didn't like them kind of in the same Yeah, that area. makes sense. How are we supposed to hear what's happening when you're writing your own plot? So we yeah. have more coupons. We have more coupons. So you don't want any pistachios? No, I'm good. Thanks, honey. All right, well, I'll pour some for myself. I don't want to, like, interrupt uh, the dinner. We're going on a double date <coughs> to, uh, so what's what that place this? called? <laughs> you got that right. Yep, 515 it is. Yep. Oh, I'm ready. It's right um, by Tijera Boulevard. Yeah, yeah. What's, what's that, that one called? called? <laughs> they do have the best breadsticks. Olive, Olive Garden. Garden. Yeah. That's the place, That's yes. Like, we're going <laughs> to Olive Garden. They have free breadsticks there. I don't know if you guys have heard of that. What do you mean, 515? He wants to go to dinner at 515. <clears throat> What was that? What, what, what was that? I thought it was 5.30. I just had pistachios. I'm not going to be able to digest. Are you congested? Do you have a cold? The cold is going around. Well, I'm not going to call them back and just push it back. We'll just have some appetizers. Honey, we have some. Let's go to the medicine drawer. We, we have, have a medicine drawer in the bathroom. It's okay. Hey, oh, on. we'll have some appetizers. I already just had an appetizer. I just had pistachios and you saw it. You, you, is it the cats? Is it the cats? Do you, do you like Advil or Tylenol? We got both. We have medicine drawer. Oh, we got everything Stop you need. Stop yelling. Cat. You, Honey, you know I don't like Bounty. They're way too expensive. Oh, well, it's always up to you, isn't it? Oh, my God. Are you driving yourself home tonight? Yeah, well. Then he can't have Benadryl. He can't have Benadryl. He can't, he can't have Benadryl. Benadryl. I'll get the non-drowsy Get the non-drowsy. How do you react oh. to non-drowsy? I just had pistachios! You had gum earlier? Look, you know, life and marriage isn't always cakes and butterflies. It's not. You, f you feel that? You dropped, a, you dropped a pillow. I don't want to be the one to break the news, but you know there's times that are pretty dark. Gosh. Well, yeah, don't sometimes worry, it's I'll so hard to, to. It's so. I'll pick it up for no, you. I got it. No, it looks like nobody in your life is telling you the hard stuff. Denise is going to need to. I got a little nose hair in here. Lift it up higher. So you love Chuck? Chuck is the kind of guy that you marry, and I did. Oh, yeah, you got one. We started dating when we were 17 years old, so. Uh, and then there was a bit of a, a bit of a hiccup when uh, we turned 23 because, um, you know, there was another man involved. We don't talk about him. She didn't talk about Daryl, did she? Daryl. What? Who's Daryl? Uh, did they work at, like, as lifeguards together? No. She, she, what, she, no. We can move on. <laughs> can we change the subject, please? Yeah, Daryl's not... In the picture anymore. <laughs> He's not really in the picture. You know, you, why don't you ask me what I do for my hobbies? I was always raised here, born and raised, never left. <laughs> I like to sketch. I just don't want to go to like those LA Holly weird places like that where you probably live. And I knit. I don't know You're why people sit in traffic. I would way rather. And I have a stamp collection that's pretty neat. Do you enjoy being a father? Oh, do I enjoy it? <laughs> mm. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> do I like being a mom? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Does uh, Pokemon like being yellow? <laughs> it's definitely very hard. I'm not big on cartoons, but uh, Dave watches a lot. If I always say, oh, there's a hidden maid that comes and cleans all the stuff. <laughs> uh, Superman, Batman, Robin. What do they all have in common? They're superheroes. Uh, and mothers are superheroes too, like Batman. Uh, yeah, so I volunteer on the weekends. It's, uh, I'm a crazy... Oh, so you guys are retired. 
you guys are retired? I am not. No, we're not retired. What? What? Retired. Retired. You said retired? Oh. <laughs> oh, I thought you said something way different. And I said, what? You can't say that anymore. <laughs> yeah, I am actually. We volunteer a lot. On the weekends. Chuck's a great guy, but there are definitely a couple of things that he does that bother me. He makes, uh, he makes some weird noises. <coughs> mm. <coughs> Ooh, you got a little... little <coughs> he constantly is thinking things are broken, and they're not. Broken. 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 <coughs> he, he also tends to just zone out. Chuck, can you hand me the remote? Chuck, can you hand me the remote? Chuck! Yeah, what? Who? Yeah, remote! What? Jesus! Uh, oof, you scared me. I didn't even remote. see you there. I need it. Come on. Okay. You're zoning out again. Here you go, honey. Jeez. You can throw it. Yeah. I'm not a pussy. I can catch it. Okay. <laughs> Do you love Denise as a wife? Is she a good wife? Oh, she's a great wife. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? Um, Nothing. We're doing his interview. Yeah, we're doing mine. Like I said, just I'm a great wife. I'm yeah. A, like I said, just go do your own thing. I know. I am doing my own thing, but I'm a good wife. So. He didn't listen to your interview, so how about? I just don't like his attitude. Oh, all right. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with her at all. Nothing wrong with her. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with her. Don't ever bring that up again. The red light mean it's on. I, I used to have home. a I used to phone. have a cameraman back. I used to have a camera back he in the did. day. He did. I used to model. For Chuck back in Took the day. Took a few photos. What's this for though? What's this for? Why is his hair so long? His hair is kind of long. You do you do hair. You cut hair. I should cut his hair. You could cut his hair, yeah. Maybe. You know what else he needs? What? A girlfriend. He probably needs a girlfriend. He probably just needs a girlfriend. He probably just needs a girlfriend. I used to have that camera back in the day. I you know swear. who we could set him up with? Oh, it it was a night camera. Kelly's daughter. Hmm. You know, but she's only, how old is she now? 20 years ago, I think I had it. Yeah. Wow. Huh. I need to go see Hamilton fix, again. I need to fix it's been this a long table. Time. I really I need to fix this table. I just haven't seen it in so long. It's a good My place. My stomach's grumbling. I'm hungry. I'm all, I'm all ready for that 515. You know, I got a candle How do you at feel? Bed Bath & Beyond. How does you, your and stomach feel? And it was absolutely, feel? it just didn't smell good. I tell everyone at their wedding that a uh, happy life, happy wife. That's but it same works every advice. time. Every happy wedding. Happy wife. Every wife. Life. Every wedding I do that. Bye. Every wedding. Bye, See you Bobby. later. This was fun. Send me the, the viral link. Yeah, send us the link. <laughs> Hi everyone. Thanks for watching that video of me and my wife. But uh, this video was uh, sponsored by Dr. Squatch. Dr. Squatch is changing the way men approach hygiene by providing high quality products and all natural soap products for you and your body. Most bar soaps are closer to detergents. You're a man, not a dish, so shower like it. And while these detergent bars are more cost effective, these soaps are harder on the skin, leading to dryness and skin irritation. While most soap companies are focused on cutting costs, Dr. Squatch creates a better bar and better shower with tons of scents that produce an intoxicatingly thick, foamy lather. A Dr. Squatch shower is an experience, a wilderness adventure that will have you coming up with excuses to dirty just so you can get clean again. <laughs> so to help support this channel, click on the link in the description and get your Dr. Squatch natural soap today. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Don't stop believing and hold on to that feeling. It smells great. It's a fun, it's a fun time when I am in the shower. <laughs> I'm not just singing Journey this time. I'm actually lathering up in this great soap and singing Journey. <laughs> hmm. What about my body of a 27 year old? Hmm. Subscribe to Charlie's. I like it. Subscribe. 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 Charlie's. Bye-bye. It's a very intimate, intimate interview. <laughs> Man, Hallmark always just gets you, just has those twists, you know? Did not expect Stop him to- Stop talking. If this doesn't have a happy ending, I'm just gonna be peeved. I'm gonna be able Can to sleep. Can you call Sherry? Uh, no. Okay. No, you should though. No. Check up on her. Check Already up. checked up on her last week. It's her turn. Mm, I'll check up on her. Okay, he's back. <laughs> he's back. I was well, wondering where that guy is. He's so t tall and dark and handsome. They all are. Every I know. 
Everyone, Everyone in, in this channel looks the same, actually, now that I think about it. No, they don't. Don't say that. The are, upstairs neighbors I mean, come. They, can you come, dude? Hey, come on. Some of us have real jobs. <laughs> love yourself before you love others, Zizan. Yeah. He loves naps. We need to get the electrician here. This is broken, honey. Look behind you. Yeah, that's good. Wait, this is not screwed in properly. What does bust a nut mean? I read that on the internet the other day. It's a nut here, but I think it means you take a walnut and a hammer and you bust it up. <laughs> bust a nut. And I'm not here. Okay. I'm not here. Oh! Oh, I bust love it. how it- Busted a nut! <laughs> Busted a nut, bulb. No, uh. no. If I, did, if I had to leave you with one thought, it would be this. Remember, mothers are kind of like dinosaurs. We were here before you. We're probably going to go extinct before you. But we have big hearts. And we're all carnivores.